Hello and what's up guys welcome to our market update session after a long time probably we are posting BTC update after a month but today we'll be looking on daily time frame as well one hour time frame on BTC and obviously at the end of the video we'll be giving one side prediction okay so stay tuned and make sure to watch the video till end currently we are on BTC USD daily time frame if we zoom in the chart the institutional order flow had shifted bullish by the break of this high when this high gets broken institutional order flow had shifted bullish keep leaving behind the demand zone at this area and liquidity around 24,400 okay basically it's a bullish structure shift so in a bullish trend liquidity lies above the highs okay so for retails and dump money the SND would be this this would be their demand zone but if we refine this SND our demand zone would be this uh, candle okay so the target of demand zone on daily time frame is 21,200 till 20,400 what does I mean by that is if price comes towards the demand zone of one day time frame we would find long opportunities in Bitcoin and would target these highs okay the target of the high is 24,400 but we are waiting for the price to come into our demand zone on daily time frame and target these highs okay but we can't wait till that long so that's why we shift on small time frame like one hour to find any small trade opportunities to target uh to either target uh, this demand zone of daily time frame to do so we have shifted on our uh one hour smaller time frame and one hour time frame is clearly bearish by the break of this low okay so institutional order flow on smaller time frame like one hour is bearish but on higher time frame is bullish okay so leaving behind the supply zone on one hour is the target of the supply zone of one hour is 21 okay so what does this means if price below this area below this high you can find any short opportunities to target the demand zone of one day time frame but we know this move down had lots of momentum so it's difficult to say that price uh, it's confirmed for the price to hit the supply zone of one hour time frame okay and most of the times we know price does not hit the exact SND okay to fix that we are waiting uh, for the price to break this low if this low gets broken the target of this low is 20,700 if this low gets broken with a candle close of one hour you can target the demand zone of one day time frame with proper risk management and trailing SLs okay so what is the invalidation uh, point of uh, one hour this a candle close above this high is invalidation uh, zone of this one hour chart okay but if candle closes below this low uh, of one hour you are supposed to get out of buys because price has the potential to hit the demand zone of one day time frame once price hits the demand zone of one day time frame you are supposed to wait not to close your cells but rather wait for a structure shift on one hour time frame if structure shifts on a one hour time frame then you are supposed to get out of your cells in profits around this area and you are supposed to find potential buys in price from this from the demand zone of daily time frame and target the highs as we told you on our daily time frame analysis okay so this was our today's short market update session hope so it's clear for you to understand and to pick the points make sure to subscribe our youtube channel and if you are fed up of exchange commissions make sure to make your new bitget account with our referral link in the description to get flat 30 percent off in uh, trading fees that's enough for today make sure to subscribe my youtube channel and join us on telegram for free trading signals thanks for watching